uh, one of the business advisors at Edinburgh College had noticed in her conversations over the Workforce Development Fund that um, here was an organisation that had a real enthusiasm for training, a real commitment to developing their staff, but also that their requirement was not available off the shelf. What, what was required here, and that became very apparent to me in my early meetings with Bigby Brown, was that they were looking for a bespoke response to a particularly unique situation. They um, are working with a lot of traumatised clients, clients who are seeking justice uh, for um, historic um, abuse and neglect. Um, and what they were finding in relation to their workforce was that the impact of the trauma experienced by their clients was having a knock-on effect on them as staff. So they set me the challenge of developing a bespoke package uh, which we entitled um, Responding Well in Difficult Circumstances, Self-Care for, for Digby Brown. I think Alison's training both um, gives a lot of information, a lot of detail, but it's also very flexible. It allows for a lot of input and discussion within the members of the group. She's not, she doesn't stick to a, a strict syllabus. We, you know, we, we, things that came up in conversation, she was able to like touch on today. For example, we talked about comfort zone and going out of that and how growth um, can be very important to purpose, which is very important to um, personal and professional well-being. It's a, a really wide ranging, but very um, thorough and in depth and, and passionate um, kind of learning experience. I'd say that the, the training is really good because it opens up a, a dialogue and also gives a lot of insight in relation to how mental health and mental well-being is really important on a personal, professional basis. There is, there is so much to this that is important in everything that we do, and whether that's helping clients, helping ourselves, helping our colleagues or helping our business, having an initial understanding is, is a start, is the, in the most crucial um, starting point. And that's where the, you know, Alison's training not only gives you a great introduction, but then gives you a tool set to be able to build on that. And in terms of your, your greater understanding, where you go for it and how this all fits together.